Hello everyone, it's Kenneth here. This is my quick simulation review of Raw, July 22nd. Raw started off with the WWE Champion John Cena having a contract signing against the number one contender Daniel Bryan. During the contract signing, Brad Maddox said that Daniel Bryan wasn't worthy of having a championship match against John Cena and called Daniel Bryan a troll. Then Brad Maddox made three matches Daniel Bryan would have later tonight. Next moment. The Celtic Warrior, the Great White Sheamus, went one on one against the World Heavyweight Champion Alberto Del Rio. At the end of the match, Sheamus was going for the white noise, but his bad leg made Del Rio roll him up and Del Rio picked up the win. Next moment. Captain Charisma, Christian, went one on one against Titus O'Neil. At the end of the match, Christian hit the kill switch and Christian picked up the win. Next moment. Then Ryback said backstage, and I quote, Small guys like you should be intimidated by me, and if you're not, I'm gonna make you. Next moment. The world's strongest man Mark Henry came out and talked about him being assaulted by the SHIELD last Monday night. And then Mark said, if the SHIELD wants me, I'm right here. Then the SHIELD came out, Mark Henry tried to fight him off, but it was 3 vs 1. Then the Usos came out and attacked the SHIELD to help Mark Henry. Then Mark Henry tried to get the WWE Universe to cheer for them. Maybe this is a face turn for Henry, I think so. Next moment. Then Daniel Bryan told John Cena backstage that he appreciates that he shows him for a match at SummerSlam. But John. Don't interfere in my matches. Next moment. Darren Young went one on one against the show off Dolph Ziggler. At the end of the match, Dolph Ziggler hit a zigzag. He picked up the win. After the match, Big E came out. Dolph Ziggler threw him over the top rope. Big E went back in. Dolph went out. Then Dolph said, "I'm too good for you." Next moment. Then the Miss hosted the Miss TV with the cast of a new television reality show called Total Divas. The cast of the show was Natalia, the Bella Twins, the Funkadactyls, and two other girls. Then one of the girls slapped Jerry the King Lawler. Next moment. Then Triple H talked to Brad Maddox backstage and told him to go on the right train. The future train or the train that went to the dead end. Next moment. Then Stephanie McMahon came to Brad Maddox and said exactly the same thing. Jump aboard and he was like, Ah, oh, the train, yeah. Next moment. Da, 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 da. Oh, uh, Fandango went one on one against Cody Rhodes. With the SmackDown Money in the Bank winner Damien Sandow at commentary. And if you want to see my Money in the Bank simulation, you can click the screen right now. Cling. At the end of the match, Cody Rhodes hit the crossroads and he picked up the win. Wow! Next moment. Then CM Punk had an awesome pipe bump against Paul Heyman and Brock Lesnar. And of course, CM Punk challenged Brock Lesnar to a match at SummerSlam. Then Paul Heyman came up on the screen via satellite and said that he accepted the challenge by CM Punk. Then he said that Brock Lesnar is his best friend in the world. Woohoo! Next moment. Then Wade Barrett went one on one against, wait for it, Rob Van Dam. At the end of the match, RVD hit an awesome 5 star frog splash and picked up the win. The final moment has arrived. Then Daniel Bryan was ready for his first out of three matches, and the first match was against the real American Jack Swagger. Then Bryan hit the yes lock on Jack Swagger, and Jack Swagger tapped out. In the second match, Antonio was going for the uppercut, Daniel Bryan rolled him up, and he picked up the win. Now he was looking for his third opponent, and his third opponent was Ryback. Daniel Bryan did hit the yes lock on Ryback, but Ryback got to the ropes. Then Ryback powerbombed Daniel Bryan through a table, so Daniel Bryan won by disqualification. Then John Cena came out and clotheslined Ryback over the top rope. He challenged Ryback to a table match, and Ryback said, If that's what you want, that's what you get. Then Mr. McMahon said to Brad Maddox that Kane and Daniel Bryan was gonna go one on one next week. Show over. If you want, you can check out my Facebook, Twitter, or Instagram. Also, if you want to check my playthrough channel out, then click the annotation on the screen or check the link below. Thanks.